What up, what up, what up, what up? You know who it is. You know who I be. It ain't no secret. It's Mr. Lines coming to you live and direct on this fabulous Friday, May the 14th, 2020. Mas uno. C, C, C. Yes, yes, yes. Let's say it with our chest. We are in here like the atmosphere. So you know what we gonna do, dawg. We gonna G. A. T. Hey, and get after these academics. And ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, not only is today a fantastic Friday, but today marks day number 100. What? 61 of a calendar school year. Oh, my goodness. That means we got, woo, 19 more days in the school year left. So, hey, what we going to do? We going to keep chug, chug, chugging along because end of the year be here before we know it. Now, our quote of the day is a Greek proverb. All right, and the Greek proverb says, all things good to know or difficult to learn. Yes, yes, yes. That's what I'm talking about. Hey, you know what I'm saying? Hey, it's like one of my mottos. The easiest things to do in life are the wrong things. It takes effort to do the right thing. So we got to get in here and make this education happen because it's a do it ourselves project. Hey, that's how it works. That's how it works. But the, what's going to be the weather today? Because that's what I have somebody want to worry about. What's the weather today? The weather today is going to be a nice sunny day. High 73, low of 42. Yes, sir. Yes, ma'am. And we already done passed that 42 already. Whew, it's a little chilly this morning for me. All right? But, hey, you know how we feel here at Carter Community Charter School. I matter. You matter. We matter. God's prayer begins in kindergarten. We prepare our children for college and other productive lifelong learning experience to be getting in kindergarten. That's what we do here at Carter Community Charter School. Yes, 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 yes. Now, what's going on? School news. School news. School news. What's popping in the school right now? Mr. missing last call. Hey, we only got few more days left. So, first things up is these North Carolina check-ins will be starting immediately. You know, middle school started yesterday. Uh, I know fifth grade going to start next week. So, these check-ins going to be popping here until we get to the EOGs. Now, the EOG is going to happen in the last 10 days of the school year. But, hey, June 10th is graduation for kindergarten, fifth grade, and eighth grade. So, beware, beware of those... Uh, you know, all those nice little procedures, you know, saying ins and outs will be said to you soon, soon, soon. So get ready, get ready. Probably Monday. Ha ha. Be looking out, be looking out for them. Be looking out for them. But what's up next? Classroom updates. What's going on in the classroom? Well, right now, right now, for K through three today is it Site Friday, and for four through five is it Site Friday. Middle school. You out of here. All right. Then up next, I got Mrs. Beatty in kindergarten. This Friday, you will have your morning meeting as usual. And then you will do your independent, complete work on the see So, All right. And have an amazing weekend in kindergarten. All right, all right, all right. Next up, I got first grade of Mrs. Williams this Friday. Hey, y'all only have your morning meeting. But after your morning meeting, you then you get in there and do your independent work on what? see So, All right, all right, all right. Now, next up, I got Mrs. Sit in the first grade. Now, once again, y'all have y'all morning meeting. Then y'all gonna do your weekly activities, and then y'all gonna do your independent activities. All right. So go get it. Go get it. First grade. Y'all y'all doing great. Y'all doing great. Next up is second grade, and Mr. Carrington said, "Hey, y'all doing your ELA? Y'all gonna do some self-paced action verb quiz on quiz? All right. So y'all, hey, I know y'all prepared because Mr. Carrington got you ready. Lock and cock. Boom, boom. Go get it. All right. Next up. You know who I got. I got Mrs. Green in third grade. And it's Friday. It's Friday. So you know what it is. Science. Yes, yes, yes. So in science, I'm going to induce the ecosystems and plant structures. Yes, yes, yes. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Let me know. Hey, let me know. I know all about ecosystems and the plant structures. Believe me, I do. All right. Next up. We got Mrs. Jones in the third grade. Y'all doing some idiom practices. Idioms. Ah, I like idioms. All right, next up, I got Mrs. Bell in the fourth grade. And this Friday, y'all doing, y'all finishing. All y'all missing the incomplete work. We getting it in. We getting it in. The day is the day to make sure we get it in. Get it in. Get it in. Because it's Mrs. Archer said this Friday, y'all doing the same thing. Y'all finishing all your incomplete work. Now, in fifth grade, hey, Mr. Lines, you know what we working on? We working on what? We got our assessments that's going to start on Monday. In math and science on area with fractional lengths. And what was it in science? We're working on the science. We're working on science. Oh, 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 yeah. The earth, sun, and moon. I know you knew it. And then we're working on solar systems. 
as well. Getting that in, getting that in, and then multiply fractions, getting that review. All right, so Mrs. Bradley said, hey, hey, this Friday, y'all doing what? Finishing any missing work in social studies and in the ELA, practice literary skills. All right, all right, all right, there's no pop, no doubt, no doubt. Hey, middle school, middle school, sixth grade, Mrs. Bats and, and math, y'all working on box plots, ink quadro daddle this week. ELA, y'all finish up Romeo and Juliet, you got your test today. All right, and in science in sixth grade, <clears throat> Uh, Y'all working on the, the sun, earth, and moon, just like we are. All right, so there we go, there we go, there we mirror the school. All right, and then seventh grade, we got uh, math. Y'all working on equations and expressions and working on the ELG. And then, once again, Ms. Ships got you all making that ELA pop. So y'all got that Romeo and Juliet test today. And then in science, Ms. Blake, hey, seventh grade, genetic traits and the Punic squares. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And then in eighth grade, y'all got the math. Y'all working on review functions for the ELG. Um, eighth grade ELA working on the Romeo and Juliet and eighth grade math and science and next up science y'all working on earth genetics over time and survival adaptions all right and last but not least show studies with Mr. Michael Mr. Michael got sixth grade working on economic development civilizations seventh grade economic and financial literacy and eighth grade economic activities and those indicators so you know who I am you know who I be. It ain't no secret. I'm missing lines. I want everybody, and I mean everybody, to attack your day with relentless tenacity. And remember, be your will towards greatness. If it happen, or family, or falcon, or flight.